Hey guys, what is up? It is me, Nixium, here with another exciting video about Battle for Azeroth. Now, I made a video about Battle for Azeroth recently where I talked about how the more I play this expansion, the more fun I'm having. And a lot of people thought that I was just chilling for Blizzard, like Blizzard had paid me money or something to tell you guys, hey, Battle for Azeroth is pretty good. But nah, man, the, the truth is, in my opinion, as I've been playing Battle for Azeroth, it's been a lot of fun, and there's been a lot of surprises along the way. And one of the biggest surprises that I have had while playing this expansion has been the dungeons. Now, you guys over on Twitch have seen my live reactions to these dungeons as I've done them for the very first time. Each and every time, I have been shocked at how creative the dungeons have been, how memorable the boss fights have been, and I just want to talk about the dungeons today. So to start with Legion, Legion's dungeons, I felt, were kind of, you know, whatever. There wasn't really too much to it. You did the dungeon, you killed the boss, you ran around, the sets were beautiful and amazing, no doubt about that. But there wasn't anything that really stood out to me in the dungeon scene in Legion, aside from the fact that we got a remastered Karazhan. And the only reason why that stood out to me is because, well, I've been playing since vanilla, and I loved Karazhan back in Burning Crusade, so it was a nice surprise. I, 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 I liked it. But overall, the dungeons in Legion were just simply dungeons. They served their purpose well, and that was pretty much it. However, the dungeons in Battle for Azeroth, I've noticed a few things that have stood out to me. The first thing that I noticed about these dungeons were what you would expect. For example, um, the locations for all the dungeons. They were diverse and they were interesting. One second I'm in a troll city and I'm fighting for the troll empire and whatever and yada yada yada. And the next minute I'm underground in some sort of fungus filled cave. And in the next second I'm in some snake underground Egyptian-esque ruins. The point is, is that there's a lot of diversity in the dungeons, and I very much enjoy that. But that's of course nothing too crazy or mind-blowing. The next thing that I noticed in the Battle for Azeroth dungeons is that they are pretty memorable. The bosses consist of everything from crazy electric snake people to giant zombie T-Rexes. And who doesn't love giant fucking zombie T-Rexes? I mean, come on, dude. Jurassic World just came out, and then I'm fighting a giant fucking undead T-Rex. How cool is that? How cool is that? But again, that's not something that's very like, whoa, okay, wow, that's amazing, Nixium. Yeah, there are memorable boss fights from Legion and every expansion. You're probably sitting there like, what is it, Nixium? What is it about these dungeons that have made them stand out so much to you? It's the creativity. In the Battle for Azeroth dungeons, I've noticed a lot of stuff where Blizzard is really expressing their creativity in their dungeon design. For example, in one dungeon, you have to dodge a bunch of electric balls and whatnot, sort of similar to the Frogger event back in Naxxramas, if you remember that. In another dungeon, you are gathering these snake eyes in order to put them inside of a snake statue in order to open up the passageway to allow you to go further into the dungeon. And at the same time, I'm playing a mage and I'm doing so many dungeons where I'm spell stealing abilities, where interrupting abilities like mobs drinking potions becomes very paramount. And even, and I know this sounds crazy, but I even have been in groups where we have done crowd controlling while going through these dungeons. And no, 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 I'm not talking about heroic and I ain't talking about mythic, I'm talking normal dungeons. Now this hasn't happened all the time, I haven't been casting Polymorph left and right, and I'm not certainly doing it before every single pull like back in Classic, but I am using my crowd control abilities a lot more, I'm using my silences, I'm using my spell steals, and as a mage it's like wow, I feel like I actually have to really pay attention both when I'm in combat and when I'm not in combat to dodge obstacles, to dodge patrols, and so on and so forth. The dungeons in Battle for Azeroth, I really can't describe them to you, but I just really, really have been enjoying them. The only one that I haven't enjoyed is the Goblin Dungeon, and you guys maybe have seen footage of that dungeon, but I just didn't think the Goblin Dungeon was very fun, I didn't think the layout was very cool, but some of you guys might be like, whoa, I love goblins, and so you might think that's your favorite dungeon, I don't know. Granted, I did do it back when the beta first came out, so I'm sure it's changed a lot since then, because I haven't done it since. 
but that's the only dungeon where I've been like, eh, didn't really like this one, but whatever, there's always that one dungeon. Overall, I have nothing but praise for the dungeons in this new expansion. I think they're creative. I think the locations are diverse. I think the bosses are memorable. We even get to fight Mogul Razdunk in the Goblin Dungeon. I mean, how cool is that? Mogul Razdunk. I think that's his name anyway. That's a character that's been around since Classic, and we get to finally fight him in a dungeon. The dungeon layouts are cool. The combat is interesting and engaging. The non-combat in the dungeons I find to be interesting and engaging in many cases. And overall, I'm just having a lot of fun. But that's pretty much it, guys. I just wanted to tell you all that if you are a big fan of the dungeon scene in World of Warcraft like I am, I think you're really going to enjoy the dungeon encounters, events, bosses, and locations in Battle for Azeroth. I always tend to make videos like this before every expansion while it's in the beta, so this should come as a new surprise. But I do have to say, in the past few expansions, I think Battle for Azeroth's dungeons have been my absolute favorite. And I hope, I really hope that when you guys get to go in there and try them for yourselves, you guys enjoy them just as much as I have. But anyway, thank you all for listening. Thank you to the patrons. Thank you to those of you who watch me on Twitch and put up with my chicken shit bullshit. And I will see you all in my next video. Peace.